two people are dead in Peoria and two separate shootings. One is being investigated as a homicide. Another on the city's south side. It's unclear whether it is self-inflicted or homicide. Paige Blanzi spoke with the coroner about the investigation into the boy's death. It's a tragedy on um, so many levels because the gravity of of this is so much heavier than what people can imagine. Police say the preteen boy was found shot in an upstairs bedroom of his home with his mother and siblings also inside. It happened just after five Wednesday morning on West Seibold on the city's south side. Neighbors tell me they heard a woman screaming and crying around the time of the shooting. The boy was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Peoria County Coroner Jamie Harwood says he was heartbroken after shootings late Tuesday into Wednesday took two young lives. The two lives that were lost in less than 12 hours apart from each other and the finality of their ages and there's nothing more there's nothing more and that's what's extremely hard it's unclear though if the gunshot wound was self-inflicted and police say they didn't find a gun harwood says these two recent deaths are a byproduct of ongoing issues on the city's south side homicides suicides drug overdoses and infant deaths all four of these are the, probably the four worst things that could happen to a family. And all four of these things, and the highest um, statistic is in the 616, 03, 04, and 05 zip codes. The Peoria Criminal Investigation Division is working the case, but they have not said if the investigation is a homicide. Reporting in Peoria, I'm Paige Blanzi, 25 News.